young people from the United States are traveling all over the world again. They're welcome in Europe. They're backpackers in hostels. People are talking to them because the image of the United States we've got away from this warmongering is getting better. At least 47 million people that the likes of you condemn to no health care in a country that I was proud to work in. These people are going to have some health care. So this is the issue. So therefore be proud to be a decent American rather than be just a wanker whipping up fear. I lived in the Midwest, in Willie Nelson country. I was a student there at the end of the 60s. I was a professor in Illinois way when they, the end of the 70s. The magnificent, decent, generous people of the United States with whom I had supper. People I sat around there and there, ate homemade ice cream with them. The difference between them and the tiny elite who are in charge of warmongering foreign policy of the United States is just enormous. Just enormous. And, 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 the tactic is to get a large crowd, whip them up, try and discover what is the greatest fear, work on that, and feed it right back. The tactic is to get a large crowd, whip them up, try and discover what is the greatest fear. Fear. Work on that and feed it right back. Gracious fear. Gracious fear. The tactic is to get a large crowd, whip them up, try and discover what is the greatest fear, work on that, and feed it right back. At least 47 million people that the likes of you condemn to no health care in a country that I was proud to work in. These people are going to have some health care. So this is the issue. So therefore be proud to be a decent American rather than be just a wanker whipping up fear. Yeah. Uh.